So that's kind of that's kind of were, were there surprises along the way that say, wow, this really works. This oh yeah, a hundred percent. Like I think we've been so chuffed about obviously the love triangle. You know what I mean? Like really, people really feel strongly about both choosing one person or the other or not choosing at all. Um, the friendship between Kenzie and Bo is kind of amazing. Like I really feel like you know it's been a long time since I've personally seen a female friendship on television where it wasn't like sort of catty and competing over guys. Yeah, exactly. Like they're just that friendship is so unique and very like familiar to a lot of viewers, but I don't think you see it on television a lot. So, oh, we're constantly surprised and delighted. You know, like the humor, just really who could you know the comic timing of the cast. Yeah, but like you just push them. You know, yeah. and like Rick Howland. I mean, a lot of people really um, you know. We have so many fans who just, uh, you know, at, yeah, at New York Comic Con last year. I mean, there was just like people pouring in to asking questions. I mean, I think that, uh, yeah, there? There was, oh, yeah, 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 he's such a lovely guy. And yeah. so you, can you talk a little bit about your background and how you got to this point? And, and you know, I hate to be that this is the one to say, yeah. was it harder to get to this point than female producers? Oh, my God. Or, I, I think it was, to be honest, like I don't want to speak for Vanessa, but like particularly a genre, right? There's a real uh, lack of female writers. Um, I don't know why that is, because more than ever, I think genre is female-driven with strong female protagonists, right? From Orphan Black to Continuum to Lost Girl. So I really want to credit Jay Firestone. Like, we've always had a very, um, you know, tons of female producers, very positive female writing team. Um, I, I don't know why that is. I just think it's been seen as a boys' playground for a long time. And Lost Girl really is like, Maybe so happy to see that's maybe changing, but you know, in general, we need more female writers. We need, we need more writers, period. But like, um, I do think, yeah, it's definitely. I feel so blessed. You know what I mean? And still feel like I get to be me and didn't have to change myself to become a writer. But um, yeah, there's not that much of us. So yeah, well, I want to get into the whole. Yeah, well, exactly. But that's a huge thing. Like the statistics are kind of staggering. You know? it's, kind of, it's kind of funny because uh, yeah. years ago, uh, Jesse Jackson made this big issue about the. Fact that every cast oh, wasn't a single black person, and I thought it was crazy. Yeah, yeah. But then when you look at the photos, oh, and, yeah, yeah. and at Comic Con yesterday, I interviewed 18 people, right. and the only black one was, I'm sorry, Zilla Thomas. See, that's crazy. Yeah, it's still definitely, like, if, I think people want to see themselves on television. That's also the thing about Lost Girl, right? Like, we obviously have a big LGBT kind of following, and I feel like part of the success has just been maybe they haven't seen themselves represented on television in a way that it's just like, Normal, crazy relationships with fights and funny conversations. <laughs> so yeah. She has a question. Like, she, has a oh, she keeps trying. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank no. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> so patient. Have, here, have a recorder. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, are you guys going to be focusing a little bit more on the police department right. a little bit? Because, like, I missed the whole interplay. Right. And then with the Ash turnout, I was right. just like, I was like, no, what's going to happen now? Right. Um, are you guys going to go a little bit more into that? I, mean, I know you have to, because I was like right. the major cliffhanger. But. Right, right, right. <laughs> like, as far as, like, you missed Hale and Dyson together versus Tamsin and Dyson yes. kind of thing? You're yes. Like, where are the boys? My question <laughs> is, what's going to happen with the boys? I asked last yeah. Yes, for them to have a scene where they're fighting somehow by a river, they fall in the river, and they're all in white shirts. I, 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 so, so, so you're just pissed off, you haven't got that. I was yeah, looking for you, what are you doing? I was looking for you to send you your royalty check, but until I sign you, I can't. I asked for a scene by the river, I didn't get it. It's fan fiction right now. If I put it on screen, you're going to track me down. No, I now. will be so happy okay, that, well, you we know. will do our darndest, I guess, for you <laughs> to get their shirts off river. fighting in a river. How about fighting some hot mermaids? You already just a hose. <laughs> so. Exactly, yeah. Our, we can, our shirt budget for Dyson and Hale is like in half of what the girls did anyway. So, yes, I'm sure we can do that. Well, those guys are amazing together, too. Hale and Dyson, that bromance is uh, really super fun, and those actors are so fun together. So, you know, with all the strong female characters, it's good to remember the guys and yeah. oh fine and I think you can look forward to a really exciting uh, storyline for you know, this year yeah he's got and, uh, some, he's got yeah. some stuff to do yeah so. So I guess he's back in the police department since he's no longer Ash. I don't know. Yeah. Have to wait and see. Uh, have to wait and see. Yeah, exactly. I'd sneak that in and you forget and you'd answer. I'm going to make a spin off of you, though, fake cops. Because uh, <laughs> this is your thing. You're like, look, forget the doubt. 
Where's the paperwork? The sexy Big hugs are sexy. They are sexy. But so. is trick okay? I hope so. <laughs> the guy was locked in a trunk. Oh, he's the so Blood King. Be, Good luck. I feel sorry for whoever's circling trick. I think they're the ones who are going to get uh, Would it be fake cops and teach you the trick? Sure, of course. As the, as the chief, we did a little joke on that last year. But, gosh, this is great. This is like a brainstorming session. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody signed up. Like, Jay. <laughs> 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 yeah, I actually forgot about the writers. Yeah. 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 It's about half and half this year. Okay, because, you know, I think that really comes through. I mean, when I watch this show, it reminds me of reading, like, my sci-fi sci romance. Oh, that's fun, yeah. And I think that is just such a lacking area. Yeah. For so many of us, so many people gravitated. I mean, do the writers have much of that kind of a background? Or there's... It's funny, to be honest, not a lot of us have worked in genre uh -huh. as far as television, but there's something fresh to the fact that we are all genre fans. You know what I mean? And I do think you come forward without the same constraints. You know, we're kind of like, well, why can't it be sort of female driven and stuff like that? And again, I really want to speak to Gabe Barstow, who has really pushed that. You know, he's like, we want to do something that's familiar but fresh, you know? Um, so we really strive. Like, we have some amazing, we've had amazing female writers on the show. It was created by Michelle Lavrata. I'm not too shabby. Alex, <laughs> Alex Cerrone, Sandra Chiwaska. Like, we, we, we do kind of strive to make sure we have quite a few people there. So, but do you think they we've can write too? Of, uh, yeah, we've had a lot of, you know, uh, uh, female directors too, yes. which is which is very rare. I mean, there's not very many female directors. Both our producers are female. Yeah. Vanessa and Wendy Green. Um, it's a very female-friendly staff, which is important as well, given the subject matter. You know? So, has any of the cast expressed an interest in directing this season? Um, really. A lot of people express interest. Yeah, in yeah, exactly. Pretty much everybody. Yeah, exactly. Pretty much everybody. Or write it. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. no comments. There's a lot. No, yeah. <laughs> is, is there anything that you ever want?